Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to get Exonic working on the Steam Deck. Let's get to the video. Hello there, my name is Levon Kaysen and here's what you need. Alright, so what you need is pretty much a Steam Deck and a Sonic Robotic Blast 2 already installed on your Steam Deck. And you must be in desktop mode in order for this to work. All right, so now you're gonna go to your preferred browser. In my case, it is Google Chrome. And so now you're gonna have to type in into the search Exonic, and then you're gonna go into here, Exonic, which is uh, through SRB2 message board. So I'm gonna click on that. As you can see, it's pretty much loaded up. All right, so now you're in SRB2 message board, which has Exonic version 1.1c. So then you're gonna click here on download. Okay, let's click on it. There we go, there we go, now it's working. So as you guys can see here, whatever you have um, SR2, SRB2 version 2.2, which is a Sonic Robo Battle 2, you must put all this stuff in your add-ons folder. So I just have it already set up to where when I download Exonic, it automatically puts into the add-ons folder. So that's what I would recommend you guys do. Have it set up to where it automatically downloads it to the add-ons folder. And then you click save. So that way you won't have to, you know, do the drag and drop file into the add-ons folder. Instead, it will already be in there. So now it's pretty much is done here. So let's show in folder. Yeah, it's in the add-ons folder here. All right, so now you're gonna go to Steam here. Click on Steam. And then you're gonna go to add game. And then you're gonna go to add non-Steam game. And then you're gonna go to browse. And then you're gonna pretty much go to, well for me I'm gonna go to documents, then go to SRB2 version 2.2. Then you're gonna click on that. And what you must click on is SRB2 win.exe. Then you click on that. And then you click on open here and then you add selected programs. And now that you have gotten that added on there, which as you can see here, the srb2win.exe. And then what you must do is pretty much go to gaming mode. All right, so now I'm in gaming mode and you click Steam and then you click library and then you click non-Steam. And then you go and find SRB2, SRB2. So as you can see here, here it is, srb2win.exe. So then you click on that. And then you pretty much go to your settings. Then you go to your properties. Then you go to compatibility. Then you, you know, enable force the use of a specific Steam Play compatibility tool. And then you go to... Proton Experimental, and then now you're pretty much gonna click play. All right, so now that you're in the game, you pretty much go to add-ons, then you click on the add-ons folder, and then you click on CLX Sonic dash V version 1.1 C dot PK3, then you click on that, and then you hear the little sound, and then you pretty much go to one player, then you pretty much start game. And you know what? I'm just going to make a new file here. So you pick Exonic. All right. So as you can see here, this is Exonic on the Steam Deck. You can see his face and everything. And yeah, that's pretty much how you get Exonic working on the Steam Deck. All right. So have you guys tried out Exonic on the Steam Deck? Let me know what your experience been. In the comment section below of this YouTube video, this is Levi Case of Sign Out and Peace, and thanks for watching. Bye.